Hi, I'm Terry with Prepped and Polished in South Natick, Massachusetts. Thanks for joining me today. The SSAT is an important part of the application process. Naturally, students want to score their best. Many of my students ask me how to prepare more effectively for the SSAT, particularly on the analogies which are challenging. Well, if you adopt Michael Phelps' philosophy, you can be golden on the SSAT, just as he is golden in the pool, 23 gold medals after Rio, final tally. Let's take a look at Michael Phelps' philosophy for success. Michael Phelps says, I want to be able to look back and say, I've done everything I can and I was successful. I don't want to look back and say I should have done this or that. Not giving your full effort gives you a fantastic excuse. The pain of regret, of the what ifs, of wondering what may have been had you made a better effort will always be worse than the strife you will face in the middle of a workout. So you prepare so you don't have any what ifs. In other words, give your best so you achieve your goals just like Michael Phelps. Let's start with some common analogy relationships that will help you solve analogies on the SSAT. Let's take a look. This analogy tests your knowledge of degree of contrast relationships. Epidemic is to disease as. Now the whole key is to make a sentence that tests the relationship of the stem words, apply that to the answer choices and eliminate where you can. So let's try that out. An epidemic is a widespread outbreak of a disease or you know, widespread outbreak. Let's try that out. Famine can be widespread hunger. We might have hit gold on the very first try, but let's look at the others. Creative isn't widespread creation. Persuasion isn't widespread composition. Mountainous isn't widespread climb. And ache isn't widespread gluttony. And gluttony means greediness. So we found our answer, epidemic is to disease as famine is to hunger. Let's try another one. This analogy tests uh, your knowledge of purpose relationships. Mnemonic is to memory as. Now, in case you forgot what mnemonic means, it's like, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally when you were learning order of operations parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction. So a mnemonic improves the memory. Let's try that out. Paint improves canvas. Well, it could. I'm not sure about that, so I'm going to put a question mark. Belief improves myth. No, that doesn't work. Eyeglasses improve vision. Well, that's true. Uh, let's leave that one for a minute. Uh, universe improves telescope, no. And skyscraper improves architect, doesn't work. Eyeglasses is to vision. Uh, eyeglasses do improve vision, so that is the best answer. So mnemonic is to memory as eyeglasses is to vision is clearly the best analogy uh, that's up here. If you enjoyed these tips on SSAT analogies, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions or you want more in-depth tutoring, either online or in person, simply email info at preppedandpolished.com and we'll be glad to help you. Remember, we can't all win 23 gold medals, but you can prepare so you have no what-ifs and strive to achieve your goals just like Michael Phelps. Good luck.